All right, if you have been complaining about the Bay Area rain for the last two weeks, it's time to stop complaining and start foraging. Welcome back to mushrooms on the street that you can eat. God, uh, look at these honey ones. For size comparison, if you see one cluster, there's gonna be multiple clusters. Here, over here. I don't even know where to start. Oh, wow. So these are honey mushrooms at different sizes. Aren't they all so cute and beautiful? But they are very parasitic to trees. So you are doing a tree a favor by eating them. All right, this is gonna take forever to process. Even though our malaria malia is edible, it can cause stomach upset, so make sure to cook them very thoroughly. And if it's your first time, only eat the young ones and only eat a little bit. I like to start with a dry saute to get the moisture out. And this time I decided to add ginger and garlic, some salt and avocado oil, squeeze of lemon. I did not know I was recording on slow -mo. Then I paired it with some pasta and my favorite kimchi. This is the smoke show from Volcano Kimchi. Let's try it. Wow, this is so good. If I were to describe the taste of honey mushrooms as a color, it would be hazy lavender gray. It's a little bit floral, but it's also kind of dark. Dark and woody, chestnutty. I just emailed out about some mushroom walks that I'm doing around East Bay this month. So if you're on my wait list, should have received an email. If you're not yet on the wait list, you can join. The link is on my bio. The wait list will always be the first to know about any forays and nature walks. Hope to see you there.